What's up guys? Welcome to Soul Survivor Games. I'm now known as Soul Ranger Z. <clears throat> and I'm playing some Vintage Story. So if you don't know what Vintage Story is, this game was sort of originated from a Minecraft mod called Vintage Craft. And some people have compared this to Terra Firma Craft as well. I, I never played any of those bots, but this is very much its own experience. Vintage Story, although it looks like sort of a Minecraft clone or knockoff, it's very much its own, its own experience. This game has a lot of charm to it, as you could just see by this screenshot. I mean, this game is really beautiful. And it's really fun. This is my type of game. So, uh... Uh, 1.15.1 like just came out today as I'm recording this so uh, I'm pretty excited I'm a little bit nervous here but we'll start a new game <clears throat> so we're gonna do a new world let's see what kind of creepy adventure valley no, I'm good on that uh Village world. Hmm. Yeah, I seen a name earlier that I liked that I'm gonna use if I can spell it. Alright, that's the one I'm gonna use. It's gonna be a standard world. I'm gonna go ahead and I'm not gonna change any of the default stuff, but I am gonna go in here to pro pick node search radius now this is kind of important because mining in this game is a bit of a chore so you're going to want to turn this on when you're starting a new world you're going to want to yeah you're going to want to set this to four now it says four blocks but according to the wiki this is referring to like the radius of the search so this is actually like a nine by nine by nine search so this is what I set it to. This one isn't enough, you know, uh, it won't detect the ore nodes unless you're like right on top of it. And this one is too far. You might as well do a density search. So I just put this on four <clears throat> so that you can use the node search with the prospecting pick. So yeah, that's, that's, that's pretty, important to do this if you're starting a new world but you can uh you can change that and activate that with a command like in the chat later if you don't do that in your world or whatever but anyway that's the only thing i'm going to change everything else is going to be default standard so yep create world here we go <clears throat> So this was a pretty big update. They added like pastries. You can make like pies and stuff now. Uh, the clay making is different. You, you you don't fire the clay in the fire pits anymore. You make like some kind of yeah kiln pit or whatever. I haven't messed with it yet, but we're gonna figure that out. So yeah, a lot of new stuff. Um. I'm gonna make my guy real quick here. Usually go like brown eyes, long hair with strands. I like the long flowing. It's just the kind of hair I have. So <laughs> uh, no ponytail. Go brown liver, huh? Uh, I'm gonna go rosewood, I think. Uh, let's go darker. Yeah, I like that. Uh, I guess the facial hair is eye. I don't know about the beard. Huh? <laughs> uh.
I think that's alright. I'm like way too albino right now. Need to. Uh. So, like, uh. That was good enough for me. I don't need no... No leotard though. <laughs> okay, I don't know about the voices there. Alright, anyway. Let's go class. So I kind of wanted to be... I've been a hunter. Been a malefactor. I kind of wanted to be like a... Yeah, a blackguard maybe. So more melee. Mining speed. Got a special sword. 30% hunger rate. That's pretty rough. But be hunting a lot. So we should have plenty of food. The range damage. Yeah. No good on ranged. Less loot from cracked vessels and foraging. kind of sucks but that's all right I'm gonna go with this guy we'll see how it works out <clears throat> all right so I don't know I shouldn't probably start collecting these yet so like the first few days I'm just gonna be kind of whoa I'm gonna be nomadic and I'm just gonna travel around a lot and collect as much stuff as I can this is insane look at this this is crazy it's a massive cliff face alright well I need some sticks and some stones and some basic stuff what the heck is that stuff Oh, the new 3D models for the flint. Yep, there's lots of new 3D models, new foliage. I love the art style in this game. It looks really, really beautiful. This game can look really pretty at times. Pretty much all the time. <laughs> yeah, this game is really charming in its own way. So we got some animals. I don't know what I'm doing over here. I'm jumping around. I'm still kind of like... Whoa, new world. All right. <clears throat> I need some sticks. I need a knife. Yeah, that is not a good way to get sticks. Be like some other bushes around here. There's a stick. Alright, can I actually make stuff out of sandstone? Okay, no, I can't. So I could do a knife though. Wow, my hunger is going down like really fast. 30% is like no joke. Alright, well I need to collect berries and stuff. I'm not going to collect bushes just yet because I don't have the inventory. <clears throat> I need to get some reeds so I can expand my inventory a little bit. New 3D miles for the reeds, that's pretty cool. Spelt. Uh, I mean, I really should be collecting this stuff, but I need to get more inventory. There's going to be a lot of that, because I'm going to be running around, so there should be plenty to collect. Some clay. Some 
berries. Collect these turnips because it's food. I need to get more reeds. <clears throat> that is a crazy cliff right there. What kind of area are we in? Very common. Okay, well. It's a rainy area. I did not. Wait, is that? Did the cattails not drop roots anymore? Or did you just like plant these? Alright, well that's different. That's different for me. Oh, okay. I guess I was just... Like the hitbox was weird or something? Alright, I have no idea what was going on there. <laughs> I'm confused. <clears throat> Obviously. Alright, I need lots of these. Flint. Shirt stones. Can I nap stuff with those? I'm not sure. I haven't used those yet. Okay, I can. Let me get an axe. It up. I'm gonna eat these because I am a hungry person. I'm gonna have to make some cooking stuff real quick. Oh, of course, I don't have any sticks, right? So, how? I forgot how to make the hand baskets. Alright, just like that. Let's get some more inventory going. Oh yeah, that's much better. Much better. I'm still probably going to have to drop some stuff. More of these. I want to get a bed before the first night. And build a little dirt hole. So I can just sleep. I'm just going to keep like exploring, collecting stuff, marking stuff, and I'm going to be nomadic for the first several days because I feel like that's sort of the best way to go about things because when you first spawn in, you know, you need to collect a lot of stuff. If you settle down right away, sometimes you're deprived of certain things. And you gotta venture out, and I don't know. It just feels more. Uh, it feels more efficient to do that. And then we can collect all sorts of food and berries along the way, and bushes. And then when we do settle down, we'll have all kinds of seeds and stuff to start growing, and food. Whoops. Oh, okay. So those do drop roots. So how come? Was that like just dropping them and I was not seeing them? I don't really need the roots though. I could probably eat that one later. Lots of reeds. Because I need more of these. Yeah, I have a feeling hunger is going to be a real struggle with this class. But the extra the extra melee capabilities 
I think is gonna be worth it. Yeah, it just kind of makes things interesting. into making ourselves the special sword that this guy can make early on and definitely need to get some armor and stuff all right so I need some wood and some some stakes trees over here so hopefully the audio levels and everything are alright uh, sort of gonna be uh, adjusting things this first few episodes but yeah I love this game it's beautiful <laughs> I mean just look at that the lighting in this game is so good. Okay, lots of sheeps. I need to get some more sticks. Stay focused. I'm distracted. Ooh, these are the... Are, are these new ferns? These are awesome. I love the ferns. I'm gonna be taking some of those later. Ah, uh, here's some sticks. <coughs> It's taking forever. I'm used to the better tools by now. <laughs> yeah, I'll take that. Because I need that. I'll probably use these. If you mix these with the reeds, you get the, some healing bandages. Pretty important early on. more food. Can't forget that I gotta collect more than usual. Why can't I pick that? Can you please pick that? Host not responding. Uh oh. Okay. That was weird. Alright. Wow, oh, this is pretty cool looking. Definitely cool. Alright, I need to get some grass to make that. <clears throat> oh, when it breaks, it just replaces it? In your hot bar that's pretty nice was that a thing before I don't remember that being a thing before I know the spears will repopulate the slot when you throw them if you have more than one but That is not how you make bales. Yeah, <clears throat> that's not how you make bales. I need more of this. So, am I just 
just being... Hold on a second. I am being stupid. Okay, so it's just a cube. Drawing a major blank on that one. Alright, sorry about that. So I need three of these. Right. Oops. Three of those. There's my bed. Alright, cool. Now we can sleep through the night. Uh, I need to look into making some clay cooking pots like pretty quickly and a lot of spears so that I can get some decent food like right away because I'm going to be worried about oops I'm going to be worried about starving early on with this guy <clears throat> so what time is it in game 15 I got a little while but I should probably look into building myself a little dirt hut that I could chill out in for now. I kind of wish I would have grabbed some clay when I seen it, but maybe get some more rocks. Sandstone isn't good. I need something I can make tools with. Apparently you can use bones now as handles. I don't know if they're any better, but that's pretty cool. All right, so I'm gonna make a shovel. right there. I'm going to get some dirt just so that I can build a little hut. I really want to fire some clay stuff up right away like I said. I need to look into that because now you have to like bury the clay pots like the raw clay pots into a to like bury it with wood and stuff and light on fire so I kind of got to look into that. It's a new part of the new update. This is a pretty interesting area for sure. But I'm just going to build like. Whoa, I don't fall in there. I'm just going to build like a little dirt structure along the hillside, probably. Did I pass any clay? What is that stuff? That's sand, isn't it? I need to go up here and try to get some of this clay. It is getting dark. It's going to be getting dark. Is this like a cave I can stay in? Uh, I don't really want to stay in there. Wow, lots of horse tails. Yeah, I sh don't want it to get dark on me. Oh, flag spikes. There's like a ruin over here. Can I like seal myself in with this? Just sort of making a, like an improvised hidey hole. I don't really care what it looks like right now. 
because I'm going to be leaving this place. I just want to make sure I have somewhere to put the bed and I'll be secure slightly. Whoa, that's dark. I need to get some torches. I need to make a fire. Try to get some clay. And man, I am just getting hungry. I need some spears. to at least have like two or preferably like three or four spheres but as long as you jump in the water and you're careful you can get you can kill some early food pretty safely I really want to try to get <clears throat> some clay though. I need to figure out how that's going to work. Because I really want to cook up some good stuff and not just have to eat it separately. Okay, well, here's the clay. Oh, new, new 3D models for the clay. That's pretty awesome. close to him because he is a jerk and he will hit me. <laughs> okay. It's getting kind of dark. I really need some of this food though. spears I need more rocks and more spears like big time quickly a torch I'm kind of pushing it right now oh yeah I need to make a, a fire starter oh, I just really need to get some food I want some of that meat I can't even really carry much of it dang all right well I'm just gonna have to eat what I have right now and get a fire I because I mean, maybe I could throw a few things. I'm going to have two of them to have to kill, too. That's not going to be ideal. Alright, well, I'll just wait till morning. I need to... Try to clean up my inventory a little bit too. I know, I know, I should keep the seeds, but food is really important with this this class right now. 
I'll be getting plenty of seeds later. I just want to get some decent food early on so that I'm not super worried about that. Alright, I'm going to put a fire here. I need to make a fire starter. And I'm going to put the bed down. Thirty percent is no joke, man. That is no joke. I think this is a good place to call this episode here. Oh <clears throat> uh, yeah, I'm gonna pick up right where I left off in the next one. And yeah, thanks for watching.